The ministry of deliverance was pioneered by Jesus himself. And tonight, if you give the Lord a chance, He will heal you. I didn't hear your amen. I said tonight, if you give Jesus a chance, He will heal you. Hallelujah. Three steps to freedom. One is to acknowledge your sin. There are many things you can do in hiding, not deliverance. If what you need is deliverance, then there must be an acknowledgement of the sin that is the premise upon which Satan has the advantage over your life. Number two, be desperate. Any man that is not desperate against demonic attacks, demonic influences will never be free. Number three is repentance. Then number four, I will do with you. Number one is what? Number two is what? Number three is what? If you are here tonight and there is a sin in your life, you have tried to stop it by an act of your will, you could not. It's still there. It might be pornography. It might be fornication. It might be adultery. But you know there is a sin. You want to be free but you cannot. And the reason why you cannot is because your will doesn't sustain sufficient authority to change your life. Because the spirit is involved. If you are not ashamed, rise up from where you are sitting. Come. You will be free. Remember, you need to be open. You need to be open. If you are not open, there is no chance for your liberty. You are in a sin. It may be immorality. It may be that you have a lying spirit. You seek deliverance from Jesus. You have to be open. The Bible says, He that covereth his sins shall not prosper. But whoso confesseth and forsaketh them shall find mercy. If you are already at the front, begin to ask God for mercy right now. Ask Him for mercy. It's a night of deliverance. It's a night of deliverance. I know you sing in the choir in your church, but you have not been able to leave fornication. Sometimes you leave it for two weeks and then you go back again for another three weeks. Because your will is weak. It means you are a slave. But Jesus can set you free. Just cry to him. Don't look at the preacher. The preacher can't do much. Look to him and ask him for mercy. 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 I'm still waiting for you in the congregation. That sin has kept you on one spot. Your mates are married. But you are a sex object. He can set you free. He can set you free. He can set you. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you. If you are, if you are sincere, Jesus will do his work in your life. Ask him for mercy. Say, Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Did you commit an abortion some time ago or you gave money for someone to abort for you? And anytime you want to become serious with God, the Spirit of God will bring to your remembrance that sin. Can you rise up, join them? And ask God for mercy.
Ask God for mercy. You went to consult the devil. Even though you are a Christian, even though you are born again, you went to consult the devil. You sought the devil's help. And unknown to you, you made Satan your God. Come out and join them. And ask him for mercy. You made Satan your God. Join them. Join them. You gave money to a native doctor. So that he will see for you. Join them. You corrupted your life from that moment. Ask him for mercy. Ask him. Say have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy. Lord have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy. Are you in the congregation? You use drugs. You were deceived that if you take this drug, a wise spirit will minister to you. You can break that you. You can join them right now. It's between you, your sincerity, and God. If you want to linger in bondage, you can wait behind. Are you a victim? Have you used witchcraft before? You use witchcraft. You did Bible turning. You played games with spirits. And now poverty has become your person. It's an unnatural poverty. You want to be free? Join in quickly. Those of you in the front cry. Talk to him. Make sure you are crying like Bartimaeus. Have mercy on me. Have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy. Oh, have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy. There's one of you, you are a pastor. But demons torment you, and you know the reason why they have access to your life. Ask him for mercy. Ask him for mercy. Ask him for mercy. If you are sincere, Jesus will respond. For those of you in the congregation, I want you to rise up and begin to pray for my brothers and my sisters here. There's serious business going on right here. Serious business. That these ones might be delivered. That they might be released. That they might be released from the yoke. Ask God for mercy on their behalf. So mercy right now. Don't hide the sin. Mention it. Mention it to him. Mention it to him. Tell him you are tired of fornication. You are tired of masturbation. Go 
to him right now. He can see your tears. He can see your tears. I want to know. I surrender. I surrender. I surrender. I want to know you more. Repeat after me. Father, I can't hear you. I renounce this sin in my life. Mention the name of the sin. I ask for mercy. Have mercy on me. Every covenant that I entered into knowingly or unknowingly let his power be broken from off my soul. Today I surrender. Today I surrender. Let every demonic influence around my life be broken. Set me free. In Jesus name. Amen. Okay, let me pray for you. Lift your right hand up. There are some of you that God will, in order to restore you, He will anoint you. He will release an anointing on you so that you can be restored. Father, if you have heard our prayers, I ask that you respond by anointing your sons and your daughters, especially the ones that have a calling on their lives. That calling that could not function because there was an accusation of the devil. I ask that in this place, you will grant that they be anointed so that they can begin to function beyond the reproach of the devil in the name of Jesus. So I ask from my left hand side to my right hand side, Lord, begin to anoint them. Begin to anoint. 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 Begin to anoint them. 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 Holy Ghost. 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 Holy Ghost.
Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost. Let there be a release of fire. 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 Hey, there's an anointing coming upon somebody. It's coming so strong. It's coming so strong. It's coming so strong. Come Let the yoke of the devil break. Hey, there's one of you, you will begin to receive songs in the night. And there's an anointing coming. 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 Lose her in the name of Jesus. There's one of you here. Your hands are, will, will become hot in, in a few seconds. It will become hot because God is giving you the anointing to be able to pray for the sick. Yes, it's coming stronger. It's coming stronger. It's coming so Oh, Jesus is for healing. There's one of you now. The anointing coming on you is for restoration. You have lost too many things. And God is releasing this anointing so that you can be restored. Father, locate that person. 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 Hey. See, see, see. Look at me. There's one of you that used charm. There's one of you that used charm. If you are if you are here, wave your hand. You use charm. You have this is your last opportunity. There's one of you here. You used charm. Wave like this. Oh yeah. Those of two of you come. Come come up. Come up. Come up. Come up. Come up. Come up. Your own is a serious case. Listen, listen. the second person. Hallelujah. Is it working? Listen. One of you standing before me. Oh my God. Amen. One of you standing before me, you were poisoned. Jesus will flush out. Okay. Join them. You use jump. Jesus will flush out the poison now. You flush it out. You were poisoned. You were poisoned spiritually and it's affecting you. Jesus will flush it out right now. Father, that one that was poisoned, at the count of seven, let your hand locate that person. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let your hand come. Okay, it's coming stronger. 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 Father, in the name of Jesus. Aha. Bring, bring him for me. Bring him. I need, him. I need to see him. Three of you here, ask God for mercy. Ask him for mercy. Ask him for mercy. Ask him for mercy. Ask him for mercy. Father, I break the yoke. 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 Please secure our light. I break the yoke. In the name of Jesus, I release you from the power of the demons that you submitted yourself to. Tonight, I proclaim you free. Free. In the name of Jesus. You are released. Father, tonight is a night of freedom. Let the ones that demons used to appear to, let the demons stop to appear to them from tonight. In the name of Jesus. Let the ones under the bondage of immorality, of diverse kinds, let that yoke be broken right now. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name.